aircraft carriers represent the pinnacle of a nation's naval power. For the last century, naval dominance was defined by the strength of carrier fleets. Now, it's time for carrier design and construction to sail into the digital era. HII's Newport News Shipbuilding Division is a storage shipyard. Every nuclear-powered carrier sailing in the U.S. Navy today was built in the shipyard. CVN-80, the Ford-class carrier currently under construction, is the first carrier to be completely designed and built digitally. Instead of complicated two-dimensional designs printed out on giant reams of paper, shipbuilders are given tablets. Think of a YouTube video, um, a 3D gaming environment. You can zoom, rotate. All the information is at your fingertips. And with all the new people we have coming in the shipyard, no matter what their background, they can take that information and go to work. Brian Fields is the VP of Aircraft Carrier Construction at Newport News. He said digitizing the shipbuilding process is a huge money and time saver. We're seeing um, shipbuilders come in the yard right out of high school, and in a year, they're off working on their own without the mentor and over oversight that traditionally it would have taken years to, to do. Going from playing video games to building aircraft carriers might not seem like an obvious career path, but Field says it's proving successful nonetheless. What, what we see is that the very little training, right? The visualization is kind of built in because you've been, you know, third person shooter game for, you know, for years. You walk in, you understand the, what, that, what that screen looks like, what that information is available to you, how to get to it. Very comfortable, right? And the really cool thing is that the old crusty shipbuilders that are there are coming to the younger, younger generation and saying, hey, how do I use that, that laptop? How do I use that information? Show me how, how to do this. And I'll share with you my craft if I'm, you know, if I'm gonna share, share tips and tricks on how to be a, a pipe fitter or an electrician. So that reverse mentoring has been exciting for our younger workforce. They're immediately providing value. We have more stories about the efforts of the U.S. Navy to modernize its fleet. You can find those stories along with the unbiased straight facts at straightarrownews.com. Thanks for watching. In this time of media mistrust, Straight Arrow News is on a mission to bring you unbiased, fact-based reporting. So like and subscribe to Straight Arrow News below. And to see all of our content, go to straightarrownews.com.